Hey, welcome back, folks, to the Toy Barn. Mac Cap Toys, my name is Kathy, and uh, I just thought I'd come out here today to uh, show you some more sales, right? <laughs> so, uh, lots of stuff happening. We had sold on not only eBay, Poshmark, but also Macari, so we got some stuff to share. But before we begin, if you like the video, stay till the end. Comments, we love them. We don't delete them, and we do enjoy them. So keep them coming. Love to hear about everything you're doing. I love being a part of seeing some of the chat that I've been noticing at uh, several different social media groups that I'm a part of. And um, thank you for all those that have been replying to me. And I really appreciate that. Also, too, um, if you haven't seen, we also have memberships at Madcap Toys. If you want to see exclusive content that nobody else sees when it comes to seeing reveals of places that we go, if we go to, say, a yard sale, estate sale, flea market, etc., you can see that exclusively. Some of the things that we sell that are kind of rare, you know, we may reveal those. So check it out. Be a member. Um, we have the information detailed in the join button below in the channel so go ahead and check that out we already have an existing member already and we thank you for that um also too uh if you haven't already um hit the bell for all notifications because each and every time we upload content of course you're going to be the first to know um yeah so you've seen the title right guys it talks about what well, we would like makari to add to those updates so they said you know they say in the emails and in their website you want more from makari you know no seller fees right and we see that we enjoy that and thank you Macari for that but there are some features that are missing that are on other sites that work well for us and could work well for you if you would add it to your one of your updates and um, I'm going to talk about that after we talk about the sales that just uh, happened today so um, stay tuned for that so we have, like I said, eBay, Poshmark, and Macari, and we're going to begin with, I believe, Poshmark. So we had a sale, uh, a lady made an offer. We had a big Halloween buy back almost two years ago, not quite, and we had two totes that we received in a pallet buy full of Halloween costume accessories, uh, costumes, things of that nature. I am still, as we speak, listing costumes from our death pile, but this is one thing, uh, uh, costume piece that someone purchased off of us in Macari. So again, like I've said before in previous videos, never um, underestimate putting on or listing uh, seasonal stuff because even though that season may be far from you, people still buy throughout the year. So don't be afraid to do that. So here it is. This is the Wuchi Bald Cap Beige. So uh, basically, you know, they, they put on this little cap here. Hi guys, I don't know what happened. The screen just went black. So we're gonna go through it again. The Wuchi Bold Cap Beige, it sold for five bucks to Allison. Thank you, Allison, we really appreciate you. All right, now moving on to the next one. We're gonna look at our Macari sales today. Go ahead and X this out right fast. All right. So on Mercari, we sold a comic book and a really nice one too. Darren had bought a load of G.I. Joe comics at one time. These are really nice. They are bagged and they are boarded and ready to go out. We put them, of course, if you watch our videos, in a Gemini comic cardboard mailer to protect them. This is the 1992 Marvel Comics G.I. Joe number 131 and it sold for $8.00. And it sold to Nick. Hey, Nick, thank you so much for that. Eight bucks. Not too bad. Oh, I forgot on the first one. Plus, shipping to boot. So eight dollars plus shipping to boot. <laughs> thank you so much for that. Going out to you, Nick, in the AM. Thank you. And that was the only one on Macari. Again, you know, we've been doing some videos back to back. We've been making lots of sales. So, um... We're going on to the next with eBay. eBay's been chugging along. Picked up a little bit since the beginning of last week, so um, not too bad. They're kind of catching up there. So on the model kit shelf, we sold here a 2023 new Snap-Tite Revell YF-22 Raptor Advanced Tactical Fighter Kit. 
Again, came from the model, sh model shell. See that right there? Really, really nice. Boxed and sealed. Brand, brand new. Going out to Ron. Hi, Ron. For $19.98. Really, really nice. Like I said, unopened, sealed, and ready for you, either for your collection or whatever you would like to do with it. Maybe it's a, a gift. We don't know, right? Uh, but yeah, going out to you in the AM. Thank you so much. And let's see here. Moving right ahead. We've got still a whole display of these. Uh, I think Darren has, we bought a whole display unit and I think we have about six or seven different ones left. One left of these after this goes bye-bye, right? This came from the Call of Duty series. It is the Mega Constructs Call of Duty Desert Sniper. It's a 25 piece number three. And it is going out to Cars and Stuff. Hi, Cars and Stuff. For $15.98. Brand new in package, ready to go out in the AM. Thank you for that. And next up we have, we've had this one for a while. I believe we did have it in our Bedford store in 2015. Um, it was on the Peyton shelf. It's the ultimate. Let's back up a little bit so you can see it. The Marvel Ultimate Spider-Man Power Web Stunt Launch Spider Cycle Vehicle. And they took advantage of the 20% off promotion um, coupon. So again, guys, if you are looking into looking into our store and wanting to save some money, there is a Madcap Eclipse coupon at checkout where you can save 20% off uh, your entire order. There you go. And this sold to Cody. Hey there, Cody. For $29.99. Really nice. Brand new in box mint. And going out to you in the AM. Thank you so much for that. And with our little guys for the collection, Darren had a berry buy. We call it a berry buy. And um, he had bought a mass amount from the berry buy about, uh, I think it was about a couple years ago. And he still has some totes left to list, but he had listed many of these singularly and this is the smurfs isn't that cool the smurfs i love this little guy he looks like he's busy busy ready to party down uh this is the 2013 payo smurfs party planner smurf mcdonald's happy meal toy pvc figure and it's going out to melanie thank you so much melanie such a fun piece and it's going out for three bucks really really good uh, still shows the payo stamp on the bottom. Really nice. We do have a lot of other Smurfs in different poses, different kinds. And I believe we have Papa Smurf too, I think. I do believe so. But anyway, really, really nice of you collect that Smurfs collection from the Happy Meal series. Really nice. Going out to you in the AM. Thank you so much, Melanie. And on to the next... Oh, this one is an international order. I'm very excited about this one. This is one that we got on retail arbitrage. We bought the whole display. And so it's starting to move out. I really like this one. This is the Barbie Olympic Games Tokyo 2020 Sport Climber Doll with uniform. And it's going out to Gustavo. Hey, Gustavo. Thanks for watching. For $29.99. If you really like this one, it, like I said, it, it's... Uh, uh, made in time, you know, Tokyo 2020, so it's already four years old. Um, we do have, uh, I believe, two more of these particular dolls, but really nice. And I think we also have some Tokyo Olympic accessories as well. So check it out. You'll be glad you did. Use that 20% off coupon, right? Um, really, really nice there. And then lastly... I'm not going to open it. Darren had it listed out, so I'm just going to show you right here, and then I'm going to probably show you a picture really quick, so that way you can actually see it. Really, really nice. A guy, I think, made a little deal with Darren on it, and Darren took it. And Darren only, I think he said he listed it today, but it was only uh, listed maybe a few minutes, and boom, all of a sudden, you know, it already sold, which is exciting, right? When you list something resellers, and it sells <clears throat> that quick, it makes it really awesome, right? So it's this figure right here, and I'll explain to you who he is if you can see him. Very, very cool. Not sure if Darren did a demo video on him or not, or a short. If he did, he'll let you know in the next one. Now, it's kind of pieced out a little bit, um, 
but I will explain. 1985 Transformers Vintage Hasbro Omega Supreme. Uh, wor and he says works. Uh, maybe that's the name of the, the Transformer, I'm assuming. Looking at the description there. But anyway... He got a really he got a really good deal on it. Um, I think someone asked him for a slight offer and he took it. So this is going out to the Transformers is going out to Mike. Hi Mike, and it sold for sixty five dollars plus shipping to boot. Thank you so much, Mike. So that's basically what we have going out in the AM for today. But there's something, of course, I wanted to share with you. Right, you came to watch the video because of the title. And we've always talked about, and you've probably seen in our binge, if you binge watched us from videos in the past, about what some seller platforms could change to make things better for us resellers. And I may have mentioned this before in the past, but I'm going to repeat it since Macari has stepped up to the plate to offer sellers no seller fees and has have done previously some updates and things of that nature. One thing, Makari, we wish that you would update, and this would help you more than anything, as help us, of course, is to add quantity listings, right? So, as you guys know, if you're a reseller and you sell on eBay, you sell on Poshmark, you sell on, I believe, Etsy, you can have a listing, for instance, this beast you know king kong with the with the beast glove here if you have more than one of him you can list one listing but put a quantity of five ten a hundred however many you have two um and have that ability so when you list those amounts not only does the quantity go up for that item but also the amount of money that you have listed as a whole um you know whether you have a store or you're a single single seller and and sell, you know, like you do on, on these other single websites. Um, it adds the money value, right? So wouldn't it make sense, Macari, if you added quantity listings to your site? Because that's going to add more money and bring you more, not only more items, but more money as far as value for listings to the site. So we know your general interest is to bring a load of sellers to the site itself to um, enhance and grow your site with more listings, more money on it, etc. But it would make sense that if you also added quantity listings that folks like us that have the inventory that we do not drop ship, not saying drop shipping is bad, we've done it ourselves in the past. But if we have that kind of inventory, we can bring it into the game. And instead of just showing off one item, for that item instead of the all five we wouldn't have to play the game as resellers to say every time that it sells on Mercari that we have to keep relisting that listing until it runs out see what i'm saying so for us this feature would make sense to you as well as to us resellers if you added quantity listings now i know there's probably other features that we would all want to see on macari a little bit more if you've got some ideas please let me know in the comments below we would love to hear from you but this particular one would surely make sense for macari just as much if not more it makes sense for us to be able to provide our whole shed our whole inventory of the listings we have because as you guys know i have even some jurassic world that i have a dinosaur that's five of the same thing it would be nice to have all five on mercari rather than just the one um you know as others like i said with ebay and the others we have them all on so it would make much good sense what do you think about that guys if you uh, you know let me know we would love to hear from you um that's basically all i got for today i don't have a lot to share that was the one biggest thing that i think i wanted to bring to the table today always want to bring a little nugget of information to you guys so you take something with you when you go about your day making sales listing and doing the best that you can do um so let me know um what you think and until next time